So we're on Grato, uh, which is one of the new Celine 60s, which has a, quite a large solar bank on it. And we wanted to show how the solar ties into the rest of the system of the boat. So we're having a sunny day, uh, we're in Roche Harbour. I've unplugged the shore power from the boat. So right now, the solar panels, there's a 1,920 watt solar bank on board this boat. We just unplugged. Um, we're getting almost a kilowatt of power out of the solar panels. Uh, we'll get more, but the batteries are so full right now, they can't put any more power in. So on a boat like Grato, you can run this boat fully solar most of the summer. So if you come take a look at the screen, we have also, uh, we've tied everything with Victron Energy. So Victron Energy gives us this screen off of a device called the Servo. The Servo is pretty neat because we can pull together most of the system to give the owners of the boat a really simple overview of what's happening. So you can see right now our battery's at 99%. And as the battery discharges, this color is going to change. It'll, they'll actually see the battery, it looks like a fuel tank. It drops down and down and down. We can see our solar right now is making almost a kilowatt, so 900 watts. Our AC loads, and we can see the DC power we're pulling out as well. This is the inverter, and we can see on this side there's no shore power, no generator. So right now this boat is 100% solar. The other neat thing with the servo system is, I have a dirty phone so I'll apologize, we can put the owners of the boat and the technicians directly on the boats. So these are a bunch of boats that are at my fleet. Um, this is live on a boat just down the dock called Dock Holiday. We can see everything that's actually happening on their boat. And we can tie in more than just the electrical system. So both of these boats have the bilge alarms tied in to them. So if you are uh, have your boat tied up in, I don't know, it's in the boathouse in Canada in Ladysmith where we are, or it's in Friday Harbor sitting or Anacortes, um, and you're in Nevada skiing or wherever you want to be, you can fire up your phone, the Victron app. We can see the boat's plugged in. We can see the state of the batteries and we can also see the health of the boat with whatever other relays we want to bring into the system. So on these boats, all we brought in is, is uh, bilge pumps and floats. Um, and it will actually flag an alarm right to your phone. So you'll get a text message to your phone saying there's something wrong with your phone and then you can either have somebody like me check it or one of your friends check it. So it's pretty, it's quite a powerful system. This one has the ABT get home drive on it. So it's a single screw boat with a hydraulic get home drive. They're really easy to operate when you're in the field. Um, the way that the systems are set up, it's actually impossible to use the get home drive while you have the engine in here. So it makes it super safe. So to use it, if the, right now we're sitting at dock, so nothing's running, but simply bringing the engine back to neutral, turning the get home drive on, hitting engage, and pushing the lever forward and you're back underway. It's just that simple. And as long as the generator's running, because you have to bring the power from somewhere. So if you're running along and things go wrong in a hurry, you reach up above, turn the generator on, bring the main engine back to neutral, turn the get home drive on, hit engage, and push the lever forward and you're back in operation. This is one of the simplest get-home drives we can fit to a boat and has the least steps.